Welcome to this demonstration video of the Interact Importing function. On any screen in Interact where we have a, a list of records like customers, suppliers, products, when we're in the, in the initial setting up of the system stage we can import data from other sources. In this example we're going to import in some products and materials from another system. I'm going to go from the main menu into the products and materials database and to the product item database number 35. We can see that there are no products in the system but if we click on the file drop down menu at the top of the screen we have the option to be able to import. It asks us to find the file that we're wanting to import from and once we've done that it gives us the option to decide from the file where the data is going to be populated. So I have a product group and it will use my product group here. I have the option for a subgroup or a category, the product item code, description, and so on. Once I've marked up all the columns that I have in my spreadsheet, I can save it so that if I'm wanting to do this import again, it will remember which columns of information go where. It is also possible if my Excel spreadsheet that I'm bringing the data in from doesn't have a column of information that Interact requires that I can choose to bring in a default value. In this case the buy unit of measure isn't in and so it's going to pull in each to every single item that I'm bringing across. When I hit the import now button the system will process the data through bringing it into the database. When the import is finished, it pops up with a message telling us how many items were imported, and we can just hit OK. We can see all the items are now in there, the default information for the units of measure, etc. have all come through, and if we press enter to pull up the item, it's the exact same as if we would manually typed it all in. If you have any questions about the importing procedure, or would like some help in getting your data file set up, please contact us at uh, Interact. Thank you.